Hey, what's up guys, Rod J here. Just gonna shoot a quick little video and kind of give some uh, perspective here. So I actually am in Kentucky, uh, Northern Kentucky, really part of the Cincinnati area, but right on the Northern border. And happened to flip through today and see some things online about how Blue Moon is listed as the official craft beer of the Kentucky Derby, the upcoming Kentucky Derby. And I was like, what? Blue Moon? Blue Moon. Blue Moon is not a craft beer. Um, although they throw the term around, if you look at the definition of craft beer and base it on that, to which a lot of craft brewers would agree, they do not fit into the craft beer parameter. They've always kind of hit on that kind of situation coming out as one of the Miller brands and nothing personal against Blue Moon, but to say you're the official craft beer of the Kentucky Derby, I don't know, it kind of bothered me in a kind of way. It's kind of like, why not just say you're the official beer of the Kentucky Derby? Because you're not doing everything that we have for the craft beer world out here. And there's a lot of good craft breweries around the country, 7,000 plus craft breweries now. But just here in Kentucky, you know, you're going to come down to Churchill Downs and say you're the official craft brewer of the Kentucky Derby right where against the grain is located not far from where we have west six out of lexington you know all the different breweries we have through that area even if you were looking at something like an all tech um they're down in an area of great flood um country boy brewing not even mention like some of the ones up here in northern kentucky like braxton and they're going to bring in blue moon and say they're going to be the official craft beer of the kentucky derby I don't know, it kind of just uh, stuck in my craw a little bit, so to speak. So I'm kind of curious what you guys think about that out there, especially if you're in the Kentucky area, that they're gonna go outside, not just outside the state, but really outside the region, because Miller decided to throw some money towards the Kentucky Derby and then bring them in under the guise of being the official craft brewery of the Kentucky Derby. It's crazy. It's crazy. And anybody that knows craft beer knows Blue Moon is not that that beer to be the official craft beer. Could have been the official beer, like I said. You know, they do their Blue Moon. It is a whip beer type style, but official craft beer? Come on, man. Not even close to the definition. So let me know what you guys think about it. Put some comments in the comment section where you think, you know, if you're okay with Blue Moon coming in, I mean, not like we can change anything, but having Blue Moon being represented as the craft beer of the Kentucky Derby, just provide some feedback. Let me know what you think on it. Love to hear what your guys' thoughts are. For me, I think, I think it's kind of crazy. I think it's a slap in the face to a lot of the craft breweries out of the Kentucky area, um, especially those more located around where they're gonna have the Kentucky Derby. But that's one of those things I'm gonna do a quick video, kind of get my feedback on a little bit of a rant, so to speak. I've never done a rant on the channel. Decided to do a rant here. And, uh, Want to see what you guys think. Let me know. Sound off in the comments. Thanks for watching. Look forward to catching you guys later. Keep drinking those good craft beers. And remember, there's always time. Get your beer on. Cheers.